Well, Kilroy here. I'm gonna do something a little different. I've got modern naval battles here, uh, global warfare from DVG, Danvers and Games. And if you guys have been following the uh, Ukraine conflict, uh, Russia's invasion, you probably have read a little bit about the uh, Moscow sinking in the Black Sea, which was the uh, Russian flagship in the Black Sea. Uh, and you know, the, the reports are not, you know, 100% uh, accurate yet or clear or confirmed, but, you know, some of the best uh, information out there indicates that, that the Moscow was uh, hit by two uh, Neptune anti-ship missiles uh, that were fired from land within, you know, 60 to 65 nautical miles um, on April 13th, the late hours of April 13th, and uh, sunk the Moscow in the Black Sea. Now, the, the Russian account is, is totally different, but of course, of course it is, right? Uh, and Modern Naval Battles actually has, uh, you know, ha has the uh, ships that were involved, or at least, you know, you can, you can try to recreate uh, this action you have first you have the um slava here this is the act uh, this is the moscow that the, the moscow was a slava class it was uh constructed in 79 uh actually in ukraine uh there was several that were scheduled to be built but they only end up building three of them uh the fourth one i think is still uh, under construction in ukraine um so so this is the Slava class. So this is actually represents that uh, that ship. Um, and that says 83 up here, but that could have been one of the other of the of the three that were actually built. Uh, in modern naval battles, you also there is actually a ship called the Moskva. That that this is actually the class of a of a, a helicopter uh, kind of uh, carrier uh, ship. So. You know, not to be confused there. Uh, I was at first, but not to be confused there. So when you're doing combat now, um, <laughs> when you're doing combat, uh, modern naval battles is a ship-to-ship -ship combat, uh, pretty much. And there, you know, Ukraine doesn't have a uh, a formal navy, so uh, there was no ships involved. In it. it was it was shot from land uh, to the extent that we understand. It was shot from land, so. You know, it, on its turn, it's going to have a land base, um, uh, uh, a launch system that it would have to have. You know, this symbol here for for a missile attack. And so, if it's doing that, I'll see if I can get a little closer here. So here is the Slava class or the Moskva. So it's going to you need to have this symbol to to use a missile. Uh, you might actually have more than one of those symbols to do an attack. But in our case here, we're gonna we're gonna use re replicate the two um, Neptune missiles with with these right here uh, that that they have that symbol right there. So we're just gonna assume that there's a land based uh, missile launch system that that had that. So these will launch uh, towards the uh, Moskov. The Moskov has, I mean, it would look at its its hand of cards, of course. Let's just say it looks at its hands of cards, and it doesn't have any defense. It, it would have to have a defense uh, uh, abilities on its cards. You know, this has defense abilities, but only versus gun combat. So, it it's it's out of luck with its uh, with its uh, defense there. And um, I mean, if it had, you know, you know, there's a there's an argument that if it you know had a repair card because. It's some of the reports are that it was hit and then uh, it sunk later. So if it had a repair card here, it might have been able to remove some of that damage. But uh, you know, for, for everything we've seen from the land combat and now from the naval combat, the repair capabilities of the uh, of the Russian uh, military is is pretty pretty weak. Um, so these would be launched. The uh, Moskva would, ha would would be able to roll. It's got uh, an ability to stop one missile attack here on a roll of six uh, or or higher, and you're using a six-sided dice here. So, oops, let's, oh, didn't see that on there. Roll on here, and we get a three. So, 
uh, no such luck. So both will hit. And so that is total of, whoops, seven damage. It's got a hole of five. So the Moskova is sunk. There you have it. We just recreated the battle with modern naval battles, global warfare from DVG. Well, it was that easy. Thanks for watching.